Hello everyone, hope you're having a wonderful day today. I'm using a new lens up here right now. It's my wide angle lens, trying out a little bit different. Tell me if you like this one better or not. I also changed the lighting a little bit. I'm always adjusting things. I, I, can, never, I can never seem to just deal with whatever I got. I'm always changing stuff. So, regardless, if this looks better, let me know. Just just give me some, con uh, just some like, not, not compliments, because if it's bad, it's not compliments. Just, just some, tell me what you think, okay? Please. Thank you. Alright, but anyway, we're back with some Nautica Below Zero. Uh, I did some adjustments to the graphical parts of it as well. Hopefully it'll run a little bit better than last time. If it doesn't, then... Oh god. But here we are, back with the beautiful game that is this horrifying, horrifying underwater sea of events. What was that sound? It was like a weird, like... It sounded it sound like my repair tool. I think I'm repairing something. Uh, I sure hope I'm not underwater. Because I might drown before my loading screen can even get me to the actual game. Oh, thank God. That would have been terrifying. All right, well, in that case, we're just kind of still searching around the place, it would appear. Uh, do I have any more food in my inventory? Not quite yet. But I may... We don't have any battery cells of any kind. And that worries me slightly because I... Not battery cells, I mean, no battery chargers. And that worries me slightly because... I still have no habitat of any kind. No habitat builder. Nothing. And I need this if I want to go ahead and make anything, basically. Um, you know, if I want... I'm running out of storage. That's the thing. Is I'm running out of storage. And unless I build more waterproof lockers, which I really don't want to do. Because everyone knows waterproof lockers are just a bad idea. They're just not worthwhile. So, I need to figure out what I need to do to get my fabricator, or my habitat builder, and get all that stuff up and going. Because I don't know what it is, or what to do with it. So, let me go ahead and eat you bad boys. And pop a first aid kit, and let me turn a lot of you into water. I probably just need to venture out into the icy, icy wake of the area. Unless there's some stuff I can get at the other base, but I can't seem to find a way to get to that base, and that's a that's a little rough. Oh, oh yeah, that's right. I picked up some salt so I could cure some things. All right, get some hoop fish, hoop fish. Make sure not to eat the antenna. All right. Uh, well, in that case, I oh I don't have any copper ore, but yeah I do. I got a ton of copper ore. What are you talking about? I can make two batteries. Considering the amount of ribbon plants I need. Alright. One, two. You know, I'm actually going to try to make some copper uh, wire in its own right. And I should have table coral samples as well. I'm going to make copper wire in the wiring kit just in case it gives me new blueprints. Because if it does, well, that would help solve my one of my issues. Because that would be a very rough glitch if it didn't. Okay. Didn't I pick up table coral samples? I could have sworn I did. Did I already use them? Hmm, I might have. Maybe I had to use them for something else. Oh well. Not important. At least not yet. Okay, so... Here we are... Adventuring out into the deep... Icy... I guess... Sea. I don't know how much of this game is currently accessible. Accessible I use in the term of, uh, you know, what parts I can not only go through, but what parts are even in the game. Ooh, this is interesting. There's the bone sharks. Okay. Good to have them back. So, do I eventually hit a void after a certain period of time? Oh, hey, there's like a little stalk over there. Ooh. There's like geysers. Huh? There's more bone sharks. 
Oh, man. Lots of bone sharks. Huh. This crevasse is... Or crevice. I still don't know. Rather deep. I don't see anything in it, though. You know, I was kind of hoping... Oh, bone shark. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I get it. You're mad. I was kind of hoping I'd find... Oh, just a regular creep vine. But some kind of... Item, I guess, is the term. Propulsion cannon down there again. Hmm. All right. As I go and as I swim, I keep looking for stuff. Plenty of creep vines. That's for certain. No shortage of creep vines and clusters. This weird, like, quasi dead zone out here. It's kind of freaky. Reminds me of the dunes. And, uh, no offense, but the dunes aren't what I would necessarily call welcoming. Hmm. Yeah, it's just this, like, giant crevasse of rock and, and more rock. And I have glitched the game. Okay, let's try this again. Wow. I... There's water, but there's, like, a giant iceberg. Like a giant iceberg. Oh my god, I almost got frightened. Actually, I did get frightened, but... I thought there was something behind me. It was just the water trail I left behind. Lots of hoop fish. Tons of these hoop fish. Nice little air pocket, I guess. Oh, hey, look at that. I'm up top. Uh... Is that- is that my satellite? That's supposed to be sending down stuff for me in case I... You know... Die? Or get stranded? That looks like my satellite. Hey, well, it's obviously cold out here. If you didn't figure that one out, what's that? Oh, that lightning storm's still going on. Oh, hello. Oh, it's just crystal and sulfur. Dang it. I was hoping it would be something, something else. Ah, uh, okay, that's not supposed to happen. Alright, well, that's a problem. Um, is this ice gonna break? I can't tell. Am I supposed to be doing something? Sorry, I'm asking a lot of questions, but... Uh... Uh... Files are in your database. Do what you please. Just tell me what you find and don't get me in trouble. Right. Precursor bounty. Sanctuary location data. So is this what I need to do? I need to go find this little sanctuary area? Uh, seems like it. Sit rep. Hmm. So I guess that would be the next step. What is with all this stuff on the surface, though? Am I supposed to be out here? Is the- does the game want me to be out here? Cause the game- I don't think the game wants me to be out here. I don't think crash fish are supposed to be up here. At all. Okay, um, 
All right, in, in that case, I need to find some alien structure 100 to 300 meters down, huh? Um, in the twisty bridges, 200 meters down. The twisty bridges. Are those those weird, like, weird areas that have all the, the table coral and all the oxygen bub bubbles and the hostile alien? I'm assuming it probably is. So weird having all this area to walk on. I didn't- I, you never found land in Subnautica, the original, for so long. And when you did, it was insane. It meant everything. Alright, um... Twisty Bridges. Okay, I do not know what Twisty Bridges means. I'm, I'm assuming it's an area of some kind. I, is this supposed to be floating? I don't know if it's supposed to be floating. <laughs> uh, well... If it is the area I think it is, I think it's down here, right? So would these be the twisty bridges? I mean, it would make sense if they were. They're tw twisty. Oxygen efficiency decreased. And they look like- they kind of look like bridges, but they're definitely twisty. So this is the twisty bridges. Please don't bite me. Oh wow, there's a lot of them. Wow, there's actually a lot of them. I'm actually about to run out of power. Oh my god, that lag. Oh my god, okay. Uh, this is why I made more batteries. Okay, going back down. 200 meters into the twisty bridges. With no form of transport, either. They really want me down here, don't they? You trying to kill me, sister? What's this? Uh... So you're just not gonna tell me what I got? Uh... Nope, guess not. Alright. Can't look at that. That'll kill me. Maybe that's what all these air bubbles are for. Helping me out. Oh, these do look like twisty bridges, that's for certain. Uh, thank you, air bubble. Uh, thank you, air bubble. A lot of interesting plants down here. Windy cave area. Between 100 and 300 meters, twisty bridges. Well, I've definitely marked that area off of my map. Or at least that's where I am. Hmm. Sips. I can't quite... Hmm. Well, might as well keep on looking. Is it down here? Passing 200 meters. Oxygen efficiency greatly decreased. Uh, that lagged me. We've got you on GPS. You're close to the sanctuary. Oh. Do you see anything? Oh, I see this. Alien structures dotted about. I'll see where they lead. Oh, here it is. Well, I didn't know where in the goddamn hell that other place was. Yeah. Alien structures, sure. But uh I need to breathe. Can I? Okay, good. Oh, jeez. Alright, so this is the next step. It's kind of weird being forced to go and, like, do something for someone else. Concede. I come in peace. Absence of hostility. Sufficient. Are you alive? Or a computer? What is the difference? Um. I. I want to meet the people who built this place. What do you want? For you to stay here. I don't want to leave. Uh, With uh, you? Forever. Oh. Why? Your masters will seek to harness my power. You've met all Terra then. It is what we would do. Oh. People will come for me. They will also stay here. That is all. I waited my life for this. I'm not your enemy. Hello? Well. Looks like I'm dead. Forever. 
Goody. I can finally live my life in peace. Dead. At the bottom of the ocean. Aw, oh, yeah, it's the Transformers Cube. What is this room for? Do not touch anything. You would not understand. But I have peace with you. Boop. Boop. Uh, I'm, I'm gonna touch your stuff anyway, Mr. Cube. Hello, Mr. Cube. Data must be flushed to an empty storage vessel. Switching. Storage vessel found. Commence to download. Ow. You know, I don't like this. Well, I've been probed. Dang it. Download complete. You have no concept of what has just occurred. Oh, okay. I knew it hurt. What happened? Well, like the capacity was identified in your cerebral cortex. That's You're weird. Head? It is uncomfortable. Return me. Uh, Release the force fields first. Return me, or I will destroy your orbital station. Why not do it now? My survival chance increases if I do not draw attention. I don't think uh, you have the power. Really? I think you're scared. Really? But you're gonna destroy you. Really? I am experiencing technical difficulties. I do not move. Why are you probing the do alien? Not move. I'm moving. I didn't mean to scare you. What is happening? All right. Well, you know what? I I think we can write her as one of the dumbest protagonists I have, I I've had in a, seen in a while. It's okay. It's fine. You know, just engage the alien facility alone, by yourself. Put something in your head. At, mm, you're a scientist, you say? Now listen to here, lady. Now you've got an alien in your face. And my assumption is it's not going to feel very good. Hey, Sam. There's an alien inside my brain now. I know we're sisters and everything, but now you have a half-sister. Can you come and save me? And have me, you know, not die? Sam? Hello? Sam? Okay, well. It's dark. I can't see anything. I have an alien in my head. My character is missing a few brain cells. Probably is missing even more brain cells after what that just occurred. I have no transport. I have no buildings thing. It sucks. This is, this is a bad survival situation. Come on. Where's my volleyball? I can name him Wilson and grow a beard. And be Tom Hanks. Because I think Tom Hanks was smarter than this. And I'm supposed to be the int one person here. Get out of my way, penguin. You're cute, but I, you're in the way. Okay then. I got a new blueprint. Ooh, a rebreather. Oh, that's what I got. Ah, well, I do have a wiring kit and fiber mesh. Oh, I don't have fiber mesh. Do you have fiber mesh? Oh, dang it. 
Did I spend it all on medkits? I think I did. I gotta go back to get some creep vines and get my fiber mesh back. I do want a rebreather, though. It would be quite nice to not have to be terrified of my... Ah, damn it. Oh, that's the thing that lowers my health. Oh, so eating a bad fish now legitimately harms you. Damn. Well, I was liking eating old fish back in the day just to fix my vitals for a little bit. Well, damn it. All right, fiber mesh. Uh, you're not fiber mesh. You're fiber mesh. Excellent. And now I have a rebreather. So, you want to explain to me what in God's name I do now? Uh, geological data. Oh, the hell was swimming right there. That was weird. Alright, well. Indigenous life forms. Did you make it inside the ah, there we go. Yep. Anything unusual. Like what? We're getting odd readings from your biometrics. No, you aren't. Hmm. Malfunction, maybe? I want to make sure. We're sending down a disposable bioscanner. Take a sample and send it up in the cargo rocket. Okay. I'm on it. Alien. Come back. Okay, so now the game is starting to go again. You know, I I'm going to be honest. I kind of liked the more. Oh. We're in trouble. If you send a sample, your masters will come for us. They'll do the same if I don't. Return me to the sanctuary. So you can trap me again? No. Then I will mask my presence. Initiate the scan. Okay. Um. But I, I don't know. I kind of liked the uh, the more how you say. Natural? Wait, can I take this? Wait, this is cool. Gimme. Wait, no, gimme this. Can I can I learn how to make this by scanning it? I can! Oh wow, they don't even have the right coding for the supply crate. Oh dear. Wait, so how do I make the supply crate then? Uh oh. Wait. Oh, there's alien chirping. Ladder fish. Hmm. Alright, doesn't matter. Point being, um, yeah, the, the other one came a little bit more naturally, you know? It was like, ah, you gotta get to this new place, but you don't have the depth module or something, or the fish will eat you and you need a vehicle, and I don't really have that anymore. And I kinda, I kinda miss that a little bit. Sam, I've got the sample. Looks normal. Okay, good. Send it up ASAP. The cargo rocket should be on your HUD. Will do. Signal location uploaded to PDA. Ah. Beach! But yeah, I don't know. Maybe it's just me, but I kind of like the, the natural progression. You know, you land, you gather stuff, the, uh, you, you start learning about the survivors through the PDA and the radio. Gives you a couple of these things, these markers, these markers. You'll eventually need to go to the markers, but like, oh wait, I can't go to this marker. I need a Seamoth. Start searching around. Ah, mobile vehicle bay. Ah, Seamoth fragments. Ah, Sea Glide. You know, gotta get that depth module. Oh, the Aurora blew up. Gotta get a radiation suit. Go to the Aurora. Ah, hello, the prawn suit. You know, I kind of miss that a little bit. This feels a little bit, I don't know. Kind of like it's artificially pushing me to do something, you know? I don't feel like that's a very good idea to have in a survival game. Oh shit, those are close bone sharks. Oh shit, that's a bone shark inside a, uh... Inside a wall. Oh shit, it's a flying bone shark! Um... So about that cargo rocket... I think I burned myself. 
Is it inside? Maybe. Ooh, there's those creepy flowers again. Oh, I can't scan them? That's weird. Uh, now I've got an alien voice living in my head. That's no fun. And it wants to kill me. That's less fun. Uh, I guess I'm just gonna be running. Making my way through this cave. Past the demon flowers. Well, they're not really demons, but they did burn me last time. Hmm, kinda wish I had more water. Uh... Oh! Wait, is this the original base? Or is this a side base? I actually can't tell. Hello! I'm scanning everything. Everything will be scanned. You get a scan. You get a scan. I wish I could say this faster, but it takes a little bit of time to scan everything. You get... You get a scan! Oh no, look at all that coffee gone to waste. Fabricator. Storage locker. Wait, why am I even scanning all these things? Can't even use a lot of these things right here. Hello? Bed! Oh okay, yeah, this is definitely not the main room. No, this is a different place. Okay. Yeah, this is definitely a different place. The other place was buried by the avalanche. I wasn't sure if the avalanche may have maybe have left a little bit. Oh. I guess I get to scan the multi-purpose room as well. This one's taking just a really long time. Planner. Wait. What exactly so I mean I'm here. I got all this stuff. Ah, oh, I got... Wait. Body heat? I don't even have a body heat meter. Oh, hello, cargo rocket. You sure came out of nowhere, didn't you? Uh, rocket needs repairs. Alright. Oh, is that why they specifically wanted to give me the repair thing? Wow, that would have sucked. If it wasn't, if it just wasn't ready. Or if I hadn't arrived here without a, if I had arrived here without a repair kit, that would have really sucked. Go, rocket! Vroom! Wait, no, it's not a room. It's more of a... Payload inbound, Vespa. Understood. If anything's wrong, we'll come get you. Hey, why not take a couple days R&R &R up here anyway? Why don't you take a jaunt down here? Remind yourself that life comes in colors besides white, off-white, and gray. And temperatures uh. below zero. No thanks. Ah, she said it. But speaking of freezing to death, if you're staying on the ice, you'll need transport. Oh, thank you're God. You're trusting me with a snow fox. If I can find a version of the truth that authorizes it. You're amazing. If you're listening, Altera, she's amazing. Promote this person. Sorry, you're breaking up. Love you. <sighs> now what? Wait. What do you mean, now what? You're getting a snow fox. There is no now what. Your now what is you now get- you get a vehicle. Wait a minute. Where is my vehicle? Okay, so multi-purpose rooms, interior modules. Okay, so like, these things are all great and everything, but I don't have a, uh... I don't have... Oh, I broke my legs. 
Where's my vehicle? Uh, can I like grab stuff from you? No. What happens if I stab the flower? Literally nothing. I can't even scan the flower. Well, you know, I was I really wanted to be trusted with a snow fox, but uh I ain't seeing no snow fox around here. Unless I just missed it. Or I'm I'm gonna look around. Maybe I can find the snow fox. Or I'm assuming they they're gonna send it down. I mean, there, there's the satellite up there. Which I assume she's in. Is it just me? Am I the only member of this team? Me? The one with the alien in her head? Oh, God. Nice, Glacier, man. 10 out of 10. Hmm. You know, as I'm playing this game, I'm starting to wonder if maybe it was a bad decision to pick it up so early. It may just be me, but, uh... I, I don't know. It, it doesn't seem like there's a whole lot of stuff to do, and... You lied to your master. There uh -huh. we go. Yeah, Altaro is listening. I covered our ass. And she's my sister, not my master. Okay, I was right about you that. You cannot trust your sister. Are you? Can you read my thoughts? Do humans think? Listen, oh. I am thrilled to meet you, and I would love to help you, but you need to get out of my head. If you will not return me, you must release me to another vessel. Love it. How? I am uncertain. Your brain is restricted. I will inform you when I process the data. I'll keep out of her back still then. You were more polite when we met. Yeah. Process that. I will try. This alien sounds like a like a dying old monk. Okay. Well, we're back here in the bone shark zone. Uh, a lot of gold around here. A lot of diamonds. Uh, it may be cool and all, but it, a lot of these things around here, I'd love to do something with or use, but I can't find. Like, magnetite? Okay, that's cool. I know what that is. That's a stasis rifle. That thing is coming at me fast. Wow. Okay, like, that's a stasis rifle over there. I recognize that thing. But... That's it. Just a stasis rifle. Not a habitat builder, not a piece of a vehicle... Nothing. Apparently I'm being trusted with the snow fox, but... I don't know when that'll arrive. Hmm... Hmm. Yeah, but no, as I'm playing this game, I'm starting to think may maybe I should have weighed a little bit, you know? Because there's not a whole lot to do. Right now, I mean, maybe I'm quicker at Subnautica than some. Uh, I don't think I am. I really don't think I am. Especially considering how long it took me to find that alien facility. But I already have and have built just about everything I can build besides a beacon pretty much oh uh, well everything that I need like like you know I don't need a pathfinder tool or a propulsion cannon or anything like that you know I don't need any other resources or anything and I, I'm basically just kind of sitting here waiting for Sam and Altera to talk to me again I'm just kind of playing the waiting game and I mean I could just roll around the place picking up as much crap as I possibly can, but that's not very fun. 
And without a habitat builder, I can't even start working on a base. So it seems like there's really not a whole lot for me to be able to do right now. I have a feeling it would have been more behoove of me to have waited for this game to be a little bit farther down into development before I began the playthrough. I mean, obviously, Subnautica. It's Subnautica. We're all excited to play some new Subnautica games because the first Subnautica game was so dang fun. But let's not forget how long that game was also in development before it was actually finished and ready to, to be done and go and, and released. And hell, even that game still runs like ass. Doesn't, doesn't run as bad as this game does, though. Uh, yeah. Nah, uh, yeah. I think I think I might need to wait a little bit before I jump back into this into this bad boy. You know, we got the, we got two episodes in, and then I'm I can't really think of a whole lot else I could do. I uh, don't know why the cargo rocket island still is on my waypoint, and I don't know why that other cache is still on my waypoint. And I am hoping that maybe I can pick up this storage container and use it or something. Nope, it's just storage. I cannot pick it up or anything. Maybe there's some certain areas I haven't explored yet, but I, I've tried to find every... Like, I've looked around trying to find all the things I could. Are you evil? I don't think it's evil. Yeah. Hmm. I don't know. There's, I'm not finding a whole lot around here. Besides the occasional bone shark stasis rifle. I don't know what in God's name that noise was, but that scared me really badly. Am I even going to get my snow fox? Oh, there we go. Cute. I have the CEO on the line. Oh. Good old. This bio sample you sent us, it bears no resemblance to your biometrics. I think. And the alien facility, it spoke your name. That's. What is happening down there, Good old? I would ask your colleague, only he disappeared. I. Silence. Where is the other one? Here, sir. If you mean to make vice president manage your people. Yes, sir. What is this, Dick I said send you Sir, if I could just. He's gone. Sam, I'm sorry. I've been stuck in middle management since I graduated. What the hell? I know. I'll try harder. I have to go. That's it. Oh. I thought there might be more. Oh. What a dick! What the hell language was he speaking at the end? Why was he talking so fast, too? Oh my goodness. Okay, well, I'm gonna have to make another waterproof locker to store all my stuff. Okay. Yeah, I, I think it might be more behoove of us to wait until the game is a little bit more polished uh, and there's more content in it. Because at the moment... That's right. Left, right clicking on stuff doesn't count anymore. As I was saying. Oh, there we go. Oh, finally. Ah, oh, thank you. A building tool. Wait. Is it- wait, no. Wait, if this is a habitat builder, does that mean it's just gonna be the standard house stuff? Uh-oh. That doesn't really solve any of my issues. Um, did I just dab? Okay. Adding emergency shelter blueprints. Wow, that's a lot of blueprints, actually. Scanner room, compartment... Oh, no, it's just your standard stuff. Okay. Hmm. 
Hmm. Gives me the scanner this room in it. Oh. Contractors planet side. Hello. Terra has updated mission objectives. Okay. Study your individual briefings. Remember, failure to deliver on objectives will result in payment deductions and or your removal from the planet. Be safe. Okay. Uh, what do we got here? Search and rescue J. Jeffries. Uh, Leviathan genetic search program. One active, one MIA. Vesper's orbital sensors are scanning for missing crew. Dive suit found abandoned near cargo rocket, zero sector. GPS analysis indicates a trajectory leading towards deep sea station Kappa, 150 meters in depth. Leviathan genetic research program. Genetic samples, uh, genetic research, uh, genetic samples from the, sea, from the sea leviathan research specimen are requested. Due to recent ice flow, its position is unknown. Depths 150 meters. Omega base abandoned weeks ago due to increased local threat levels. Alien research data at the base may prove vital to our efforts. 100 meter depths. <sighs> yeah. So there's a couple things I can do. Okay. I will admit though, I'm not really I'm not really liking being told what to do. I kinda liked just doing it back in the day. I don't know. This is I'm not I'm not too keen on this change, personally. But uh the abandoned near cargo rocket zero sector. So is that near the Cargo Rocket Island? This is 150 meters in depth. Do I just go to the Cargo Rocket Island, take the depth down? Also, the, the skeletons of Leviathan does not make me feel good in any way, shape, or form. Um, having to find the skeletons of Leviathan sounds just straight horrible. Because if they're, they're Leviathan skeletons, it means it died. And that means I'm going to need to figure out how it died. And I don't like that. Oh man, I was hoping it would do something cool. Bone sharks again. So many bone sharks. So many bone sharks. There's a little cave down there. Maybe I should try that cave. Once my frames recover. Let's try the cave. This was a mistake. Processing is complete. You will board me a new vessel. Oh, will I? How? What kind of vessel? I have not granted you permissions for that information. Okay. I can't help you if you don't tell me. Which data formats do you accept? Words, mostly. I have added the information to your data bank. Thank you. Listen, I need something to call you. We do not use words that way. Why not? I used to have a pet barwell. I called him Ketchup. Don't make me name you two. You may append my seed code to the species designation. You may call me Al Allen. I waited my whole life to meet a space-faring alien. His name is You're Alan. telling me your name is Alan? Is it insufficient? No. No. Alan. It's perfect. Let me see about that vessel. Thanks for playing Early Access 1. Story and gameplay from here are very broken until later updates. Wow, they specifically said very broken. Well, at least they're, at least they're honest about it. I'll, I'll give you that. Alien vessel. Okay. All right. So the game. Is, all right. Well, you know what? At least when when I when I said that I was like, oh, I, I think I should probably have waited. At least I know I was right. That's done with the early access for now. Okay. 
I, I guess I can just mess around with the habitat builder and stuff, but no, I'm gonna wait. I'm gonna wait till they add some stuff. So for the time being, I'm gonna go ahead and wait till they add some more stuff to Subnautica, because I'd like, I, part of the fun is the building and the, um, the, 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 I like the progression. I really like that progression. I like going from thing to, like, from Sea Glide to Sea Moth to base to prawn suit to Cyclops and everything in between. And I really like that stuff. So I'm going to wait till they add more stuff and then we can go ahead and continue the game from there. So this will be the last episode of Subnautica you'll see for quite some time. Probably going to hop onto the Claire storyline of Resident Evil instead. And then from there, who knows? Maybe you're in the blind forest. All right. I'll see you all later. Bye-bye.